third guy to come in at, at outside linebacker? Yeah, Carl, Carl has been um, – he, he is – mainly at the hog spot right all right he, he only solely works at the hog spot so right now i would say him and gabe richardson are in the mix right um so yeah carl right there for sure so he, he's definitely in the mix carl's had a good camp he's done well and um so he battles him and gabe and Dwayne. we all kind of battle it out and we all compete and uh, try to get the best out of each other for sure you think Dwayne will play razor then on, on thursday too yeah so if we to start the game and base right. um Dwayne eugene will be the razor I'm sorry, excuse me. Uh, Randy Ramsey will be the Razor, and uh, Dwayne Eugene will be the Hawk. So other than Carl, Randy, uh, Gabe, and, and Dwayne, who else um, may come into the mix? Uh, Henry. Henry. Henry would be in the mix as well at Razor. Sure. What is Dwayne, I'm sure somebody's already asked you this before, but what, what has Dwayne done over the last you know week or two to, to put himself in a position to start? Well, he's such an impressive guy. He's really just, he's done a tremendous amount of work. Um, He's really gone for it, you know, I've kind of challenged him, hey, how good do you really want to be? How good can you be? Uh, what's the vision that you have for yourself? Uh, here's the vision that we have for you as a staff. And um, let's see if we can make this thing happen. And um, he, he's really poured his heart into it. And you can tell the guy loves football. Um, you can tell he's a great teammate. Everybody respects him. Um, he plays with, he comes out there, has great leadership qualities. Um, and then he's put the work in on the field. Uh, on the field, he's really, applied himself to bring great toughness to be able to set the edge out there he's provided pass rush out there he is um he's just really gone for it. he's tackled well he's going to hunt for the football everything that we've asked for him to do and in including assignment wise um right now he, he's earned that spot i read said the other day that, that paul rose has got a, a good way about him of getting on players if he needs to correct them without demeaning them yeah to where they don't tune him out you know they they, they, they buy in but working with paul what's what's been your take on that yeah he's awesome uh, like I was saying before I really um, learned a lot from him he's very passionate he's very thorough he's very detailed he's well organized with the staff who come in there he's got a plan he's ready to go here here's he wants to make sure that we all know it and it's the same way with the players everything is very detailed now on the field he's extremely passionate um, he's, he's got a great presence about him. Um, the players, everybody looks up to him, everybody respects him, um, and he wants us to play hard. And, and we follow his lead, we kind of go with him, and I've, um, I've had a lot of fun working with him, for sure. That's it. Yeah. I know you're not playing Alabama Thursday night, not, not yet, but um, it's good. it is going to be your first game with the Razorbacks. What, what have you heard about them? Um, like, what are you, are you looking forward to hearing the Hogs called? Or I guess you've heard them called before. Yeah. As a, as, as a, I guess you've been to we've been to some of those LSU games. Right? I have. I was always the opponent, though. Yeah. Um, I'm definitely looking forward to it. It, it yeah. kind of gives me some gives me little goosebumps, and um, it's such a, a really neat thing to know that you're a part of something bigger than yourself. Um, such an institution that's been around for so long, such a tradition, and it, to be a part of that, I, I can't wait. And I'm really excited about it, and uh, it kind of fires me up. So definitely looking hey, forward to hearing it. Hey, at other stops, have you been on the field or upstairs? I've been both, um, pretty much my whole career. I've split. So, and in Atlanta, I was up in the box the last two years. Uh, before that, I'd been on the field, yeah. and um, so it's kind of. 50-50 where I've been. I, I do have a little bit of composure up there. I'm, I'm kind of, um, I've had been asked that before. I'm not all over the place. I'm very, um, I'm very calm on game days for sure. And, um, and I'm not around the guys either. So it's my job to relay the information that I'm seeing and uh, I'll get it down to those guys. Give you like Paul's eyes in the sky. Yeah, I, well, I'm going to look at my guys first, and then I'm going to look at the point of attack and then help out the best way I can. Because we know sure. you like to move. I'm just trying to I love to move. We're trying to picture you. Yeah. All the stuff about he didn't like me. I'm sitting around thinking, man, what about Chad? He literally bounced. So you're not literally bouncing off. I'm all over the place. No, but I'm, I'm, usually, I'm usually really, really calm. And, uh, yeah, I'm excited. It's going to be fun. Yeah. How anxious are you to see how you guys do in the 3-4 in a game for the first time? Yeah, I'm really excited to see it. You know, challenge our guys for our style to come through. You know what we what we ask them to do. Just see, I want to see them play hard and really play fast, strain to finish. You know, I want to see us uh, with the work that we put in. You know, I want, want to see if they can bring that to the field and challenge them. And um, yeah, I'm extremely excited to see where it takes us. Now, Texas Southern, obviously, you guys have a lot better personnel than they do, but they did play a three-four. Was that helpful at all in seeing how family is going to attack a three-four? Yeah, I, I think it is. You know. They, they've had some um, three, four schemes that they've seen in there, you know, that they played last year as well. But definitely getting a bulk of it, 
you know, with Texas Southern, I think that does give you somewhat of a picture, um, you know, what you could what you could catch out there on TV. So it was, um, you know, it was just real quick. So it's, it's tough to see, but absolutely.